Good morning, everybody, and happy Thursday. 53 degrees and 11 degrees Celsius. It's a little on the warmer side here for November for early morning. Oh, woke up actually before my alarm, and it's like, okay, we're going to turn everything off. Yeah, I laid down. Well, we went up pretty early, honestly. I laid down probably around 8.30. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't edit till this morning, and the video is still exporting, so when I get home, i got to get that out, but I got to, I really should get gas in this thing, and I need a rear wiper blade. I don't know if I'm going to do that right after work, or if the dogs and I are going to get out. It's uh, very foggy this morning. Very, very foggy. So, give me a second here, and I'll spin you around. All right, that's already loose, and it unscrewed, went the wrong way, but anyway, yep, very foggy. Right, tighten that back up. <laughs> Things come unthreaded too easy. Of course, it's not that cold either for the cool head to be locked up, because this thing does not like cold temperatures at all. Oh, but it's a very, very useful device, so... Six to one today, tomorrow, and Saturday, and then close on Sunday. Just kind of looking ahead and seeing who I had what days. Today's not going to be a real fantastic employee day because we've got no one coming in at nine o'clock to run register, which means <sighs> I'll be on curbside. Another opener will be on. Register, so I'll have to cover his break. So fun, 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 fun times. Love it. Tomorrow's better. But of course, it's Friday. So, all right. Oh, yeah. I didn't get out in time for this shot, but that's all right. It's, I mean, it's, it's cloudy and whatnot, so there's, there's nothing to even see today. No sun rising or anything. One of these mornings, I'm going to wake up on a day off, just come out here and Try to, I gotta try to figure a, a convenient place to park to walk up here. Alrighty, I will see you guys after work. So, hope you have a great day, and I'll catch you in a few short seven hours. Holy buckets, it's warm outside. 63 degrees, 17 degrees Celsius. Wow. I'm kind of closely paying attention to Ken, Ken Slovis, because he does the same thing to get an idea what Lithuania's temperature is like, and they're in the 50s. We're, 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 we're definitely way above, but I think we're supposed to start chilling off here. But it is an exquisite day outside. Second, I'll loosen it up. I'll try to turn you around without having it fall off. Yeah. That's what we're looking at right now. Blue skies and an Ollie's building. So here's the problem. I don't know if you guys can see it, but the line's in the road on the other side, and this guy is parked, or lady, is parked so far back that she's not hitting them. Oh, I gotta get cat litter out of here today, too. I was too tired after yesterday. Not that I'm much less tired today. All right. Gotta clean the inside of this windshield. I really do want to take the dogs. I need to get gas in this thing. I didn't go 100 miles yet. So I'm not in desperate dire need, but <clears throat> with it being this beautiful outside, I think the pups would enjoy a little outing. Take them to the park. Let them sniff. All right, good afternoon, everybody. It is what now? 3.25. Eh, I laid down for a minute. Didn't fall asleep this time. I was watching uh, I Dig It 4. Devin out in South Carolina doing some... Was he in North Carolina today? North Carolina. The man travels all over the place. And that's kind of why I did the video the way I did it yesterday. Obviously, I only have one camera. I could have used the pocket, but it was a it was a tiny little leaf moving job. Eh, two hours worth. It's the only downside to, to battery power though is you know when they run out, you can't just refill them. I mean 
And the problem is I ran both of them out before the other one was charged. <laughs> All right, big guy did his business, but we were talking with Don and Roy. And then, of course, uh, Lupin decides to come out and get chased by two dogs. <laughs> Neither one of them wanted him to round. <laughs> it is uh, definitely cooled down. Uh, I'm going to say it's probably much lower in the 60s than it was, if not in the 50s at this point. Uh, 61 and 16. That's well, not that much lower. I don't know. Maybe it's coming out of that cold building. It just felt warmer this afternoon. Everybody was like, oh, it's so cold in here. Meanwhile, you know, I'm uh, ready to strip all my clothes off from working. So, oh, that sun is bright. I keep forgetting about sunset coming down here. You gotta be more mindful. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, so I uh, was on the phone with Tim and I was like, ah, what did I get for my mileage today? Yeah, I'm like two miles short somehow. So dogs aren't going to be real happy with me that we have to go like 1.8 miles. And he's really not wanting to do this tonight. He's my little go-to guy. What was that? What are you jumping over? I'm not going back on that side. You're going to take at least a half a lap, little dog. you got to get some exercise. Very laxful, lax on exercise yesterday. You need to do something with yourself. <laughs> I really don't have much tonight, guys. I'm sorry. Just uh, one of those days where not a whole lot going on. All right. Well, Sherry just messed me again. She must have watched the video where I said about Verizon Messenger. No, Verizon is actually discontinuing their messenger altogether. They're not going to have it anymore. That is really weird. They've had that for a long time. But I guess they don't want to do RCS. All right, it's been like 49 minutes of walking with tail. Now I got Pre out. And we're like six tenths of a mile away from being complete for the day, but I'll try to take her further than that if I can. Oh yeah. And Mr. Sun is blinding me. I'm trying to get some cool little shots. I'll try to show you here. I got this shot, but in like vertical. And see if I can block the sun out how I did it. Kind of use the tree to block it out. Back up just a teeny bit. But yeah, get the sun out of the lens. And the tree is lighting up. Really pretty. I'm sure you've seen the pictures already. Because I'm going to edit them though. That'll remind me if I forget, because I think I took it off everything. Oh, goodness. It is quite insane. The difference in time to import from the internal 47 gigabyte drive versus the SD card. It is just insane. It's just like <laughs> done. doesn't matter if I run the whole card. It takes less than a minute to import 47 gigs off the internal drive versus the external that takes forever with hardly anything. I mean, those time-lapse videos, those they were shot in time-lapse and they still took forever last night. So, kind of why I didn't edit that and I was beat. So, it doesn't take much anymore. I'm, I'm cooked at work by the time we go to first break. By nine o'clock when the store opens, I could lay down and take a nap. I really could. Especially this morning with like freaking five pallets of cooler. A lot of it was butter too. We got a whole pallet of butter, so not that I had to put it all out because there's way too much of it, but the amount I did have to put out, I think there were three left out of 12 and it's above my head. It's just about up here. Then I have to lift big things of four sticks of butter. Yeah, fun times. I'm not sure what just, oh, squirrel. <laughs> it was a squirrel, that's what it was. Yeah, we have time to get the phone out to zoom in on him. Oh, yeah. I don't know what we're... Well, we are doing... I think we're doing fried cabbage and potatoes for dinner tonight. I think that's what the menu was last night. Could change tonight. Who knows? <laughs> I don't know. Whatever. Food's food. And I'm ready because... Uh, yeah, I ate at, what, 9.45 this morning? My peanut butter and... Uh, I had my... Grape and my strawberry Uncrustables. 
I had two baked potatoes though before I left for work that were left over from last night and oh my god were they good. So basically what I've been doing with the potatoes is stick them in a Tupperware container, put, clean them so that they're wet. Put, I just, I didn't have any of the spray butter to pour on them, so I just took regular butter, cut it in small, in slices like, and laid it on top, and then sprinkled salt and pepper on them, put them in the microwave, then covered them with that, uh, not a, a saran wrap, but we have that other one that has like the sticky, I forget what it's called, it's like a sealing type of paper, or wrap, and then, um, put them in the microwave for 11 minutes. I had like six of them in the container. So they, they were covered and they really cook. And then the butter drips down underneath and just gets, just kind of steams through them. Oh, were they so good. So good. Between tenants driving by and there's one lady out walking. She's doing quite a long walk too. So to keep kind of shut the camera on and off. But now I'm just filming princess. No traffic, they can go by. Uh, I'm trying to see if the vet's open, but Mr. Sun is blinding me. I forgot my sunglasses a second left. The bus is over. There's a lot of cars on this side. But I think that's like the training thing. Eh, I don't think we're gonna. Nope, there's cars over there. Okay, they're open. Sorry, Pri. I know she wants to go over and sniff, but she can do that on a whole lap and she can sniff the whole property. Plenty of other doggies around here. Um, actually, this dog was out down here, so I think we're going to stop. Stop, Priya. And hopefully he's inside because there's no fence between here and there just that tree line and he did attack one other dog she is so confused why we just turn around she's like i don't get it why do we come all the way down here and then just turn around dad why do we do that come on come on let's keep moving come on come on let's keep it moving especially right here because there's an opening for that dog to come through if it is out he was out a minute ago with the people. Well, more than a minute ago now, because it's when the tail and I were down here. What do you guys think of the low angle of the dogs? Does it give you a little bit, a uh, little different thing to shoot? I was like a 360 around me. Yeah, she wants to go over. What are you doing? What are you doing? You a happy girl? Are you a happy girl? You know, you were not a happy girl when daddy closed your tail in the door. Oh yeah, that was an incident that happened to me. All right, come on. I let her out on the patio because, of course, as soon as I come home, she starts barking and gulping. <sighs> I'm trying to, and she's like coming in like a slug and the door closed and it whaps her tail. Oh, did she scream? Then runs off into the living room crying. Can't blame her. <laughs> then I found out that she was a very bad girl and she peed on the rug again. Yes, you did. She goes, don't tell everybody my dirty secrets, Dad. Don't tell everybody. You've got like an acre of puppy pads upstairs, Priya. You don't need to pee on the rug. So, well, I smell it on, I smell me on there. Same spot every time. God, look at this guy. Be a good night for star photos. But I gotta be to work at six in the morning, so. Although it will be dark really, really early. That is the only nice thing about winter. I can get star photos at a much earlier time. I wonder if I should try the uh, Milky Way earlier at night. She hears the young kid playing basketball down there. She is not happy about being in this area. We completely avoided a lot of things there. As well, the other dog was out. Come on, this way. This stupid thing keeps falling off. Priya, I need a tenth of a mile, baby. Tenth of a mile and you're done. She's still freaked out about the, ooh, I think she's gotten out of her harness a little bit here too. Hold on, I gotta fix that. I really want to look back and see if her harness was on wrong the whole time or if it was when I tried to guide her away from all the things that she doesn't like. Other dogs and little children. She wants to eat little children and she is mm, pretty feisty around other dogs actually. All right, I think we can just do the bottom half here and be done. And we're at 70, 175, I need 180. Should be good enough. Well, I don't think there's going to be much more going on, so thanks for watching. Have a good night. Stay safe. I'll catch you tomorrow.